yellow, blue, and red. These are the first hues which we call the primaries. Of their own will, the primaries mix with one another, creating green, violet, and orange, the hues we call the secondaries. Not satisfied with only six hues, the primaries and secondaries mixed, creating the intermediates. Thus, the order of the color wheel was born. Two groups called schemes were in charge of the order. The first was the triad of primary. Made up of the primaries, each member was placed equally apart from each other on the will to maximize control. The other scheme was made of the secondaries and was called the secondary triad. It too had its members placed equally apart. There was a short time of peace, but it didn't last. Friction between the hues grew. Other hues began creating schemes of their own. At first, it was a minor junction of hues located next to each other in the schemes called analogous. Then, as the hues became more daring, they created schemes with members opposite of them on the color wheel. These were called complementary. If a hue's complement would not work with it, it would team up with the hues next to its complement. This was called split complementary. Sadly, even in these groups, the hues were not happy. Their hatred for each other grew until two non-colors were created named Yin and Yang. Their only objective is to destroy everything colorful by using the tint attack to lighten things and shade attack to make things darker. However, there are still those who wish to revive the order of the color wheel.